After the murder of George Floyd, we heard athletes speaking out wanting justice. But Denver Nuggets rookie Michael Porter Jr. has a different spin to the situation. What's going on, fun fam? It's your boy Chris, also known as CK2K over on my YouTube channel. But make sure you subscribe right here, hit the notification bell, and don't forget to like this video. And yes, Michael Porter Jr. has a bit of a different opinion than the rest of us when it comes to the situation that happened to George Floyd. A video showing the death of George Floyd by four police officers led to a wave of responses from people around the nation. One response came from Michael Porter Jr., which had a different twist than most responses you were seeing online. Michael Porter Jr. took to Twitter saying this, as much as you pray for George's family, gotta also pray for the police officers who were involved in this evil. As hard as it is, pray for them instead of hate them. Pray that God changes their hearts. Now, as you probably expect, not many people were siding with Michael Porter Jr. on this opinion. He was getting tons of hate on social media for this take, as you'd probably expect, but he also got some responses from his own peers. LA Clippers Sixth Man of the Year Lou Williams simply responded saying, nah. And Philadelphia 76ers forward shared the same sentiment, saying, hell no. Nah. Knicks forward Mo Harkless couldn't believe this tweet either and is calling for his Denver teammates to get him by responding, somebody talk to their rook, please. Yeah, I'm with Mo on this one. I mean, although I do kind of, sort of, maybe see what Michael Porter Jr. is trying to say, the timing of a tweet like this is not going to be perceived the way that you might think it would be Michael Porter Jr. Now, in a time where people looking like me or looking like George Floyd are getting killed every single day. It feels like we have a new situation every week. With what happened to George Floyd, people are not going to be looking for peace for the officers like the ones that were a part of what happened to George Floyd. Now, do you guys think that this tweet was a bit disjointed? A lot like pretty much everyone else that saw this tweet. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. It's me, your boy, Chris. I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. I'm out.